Hello and welcome to Stotch Ross Maths key skill video on changing the subject of the formula with multiple fractions where the subject is in a denominator. So we want to make x the subject of this and to make x the subject just means to get x on its own on one side of the equation, preferably the left side. Now this is quite complicated because we've got lots of fractions going on here and we need to get that x on its own on one side of the equation. Now whenever you're trying to either solve equation or change the subject where you've got two fractions that are either added or subtracted, I would combine them into one fraction. So tip, combine into one fraction. And we do that if you've got a subtraction or an addition of two fractions here. And that will allow us to simplify more. So let's just copy this out a bit bigger. Now to subtract these fractions, we cover subtracting algebraic fractions in another video, and if you haven't seen that, please watch it now. But let's think how we usually subtract fractions. Well, a quick way we can do it is just multiply the denominators, so b times x, and then we cross multiply the numerators. So we do the 2 times the x first, so 2x, then we've got minus in the middle, and then 1 times the b. 1 times b is just b. So that's the quick way to subtract fractions. Now, it's a bit simpler because we've just got fraction equals just a single fraction here. Now, if that happens, where you have a over b is equal to c over d, we cover that in another video. And what you do is you again cross multiply. So you do the a times the d. So a times the d is equal to c times the b, so bc. So that's a kind of like different kind of cross multiplication trick. So we apply that here. We do the 2 times the bx, which is 2bx, and that's equal to the 2x minus b multiplied by the a. So we get this cross in the middle, hence why it's called cross multiplication. So we've got a times, I'm going to put a bracket here for the moment, a times 2x minus b. And now we completely got rid of the fractions, so we're on the home straight now. So let's just expand this out first. So we've got 2bx equals a times 2x is 2ax. These variables should go in alphabetical order. a times minus b is minus ab. And um, think about our strategy when we're trying to get x to be the subject. We need to isolate all the x terms on one side of the equation. Now we could either move this 2ax over here, by subtracting 2ax, or we can move this 2bx over here by subtracting 2bx. So it doesn't matter either way. Uh, let's just say we want to get all the x terms on the left-hand side. So we do 2bx minus 2ax. And on the right-hand side, well, we subtracted the 2ax, so we're just left with minus ab. So let me just write what we've done there. We subtracted 2ax. And once we've done that, remember from a previous video, once we've got all the x terms on one side, we factorise out the x. So we've got x times 2b, and x times what gives you minus 2ax? Well, it's minus 2a. We've still got that minus ab here. And then finally, because the x is on its own and it's been multiplied by 2b minus 2a, we can get rid of that times by 2b minus 2a by just dividing by that whole bracket. So we get x equals minus ab over this whole bracket here. But we don't need the brackets anymore because there's nothing around it like that. Yep, and that is the final answer. Now we could tidy this up if we wanted to because I don't like expressions starting with a negative term. So we could multiply top and bottom of our fraction by minus one and that's gonna tidy things up a bit. So if we times the top by minus one, the minus becomes a plus, so it's just positive AB. And if we multiply the bottom by minus one, that becomes minus 2B, and that becomes positive 2A, it just reverses the signs. And I wanna put the positive term first, so that minus 2A becomes positive 2A, put that first, and that 2B becomes minus 2B, so I'm gonna put that next. And that is, you can see that's nicer than that answer, isn't it? We've got less symbols there. So that is the correct answer, and even better than that answer.